glass half empty. I guess. Perspective. Yeah. What is? What is this? This is good. This morning when I woke up, I felt like I was hit by a bus. This is how you know that you're getting older because um, the way how I felt, I felt like an old lady. Just getting home from work. Today was kind of tight because today was a rainy day. Not my favorite. Oh, the ambiance of these two little roses are so cute. I got these two little roses from one of the porters at work yesterday. Cutest thing ever. I'm gonna insert my Insta stories right here so you guys can see. Heck, so y'all can see. But they're the absolute cutest. The stems are a little bit longer, and I cut it down a little bit and I put it in some water, and they are thriving. Yesterday they look like they were dying a little bit because I was coming home with them in my pocket the pocket on my scrubs so they weren't looking too cute but like now they're thriving love that for me yesterday when I was coming home I stopped by the liquor store because it was my friend's sister's birthday party and if you know anything about Jamaican parties if you don't have a gift bring a bottle bring a bottle anyways so I stopped by the grocery store and I was getting her wine and I got her a rosé. I forgot what the one that I got her is called, but the the box that it came in was like so cute and like so presentable for like her birthday, so that was nice. And then I got her a Stella Rosa Black because this is one that I've been seeing swirling around for a hot little minute. And I was very excited when I started at the store because I watch a few YouTubers who talk about this. So I bought one and then I bought uh Pinot Grigio this one is a little bit different than the one that I typically drink um yeah this one is a little bit different from the one that I normally drink but nonetheless Pinot Grigio is my favorite white wine so love that for me so I had to top up on this again and it's not even that expensive the Pinot Grigio was 11 mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm, girl oh this just shows the overall total but I know that this one here was 11 99 the Stella Rosa and the Pinot Grigio was the one that was the most expensive. I ended up spending $41.35. So that was cute. Not really, but that was cute. And then I got two packages. Let's just put these right here for right now. So I'll go in the kitchen. Can I just trash knife? What is the dress? This dress here is a dress that I ended up wearing to my friend's sister's birthday party last night and uh, if I'm taking it out of the package this is the new one so I had ordered it and it didn't come in and so I had to like ask Amazon for a replacement however when I replaced it was like was it Thursday evening like Thursday night late Thursday night Thursday evening and I thought it would have come by like Friday it did not so luckily I had another blue dress that I had bought like last week so I have that as backup even though I know that I didn't love that one which is why I ended up buying this one I'm gonna insert like a picture to show y'all how this one looked but I just have like a second one of it so I guess I'll just have it I never really liked royal blue on me until I tried that dress on last night it was so nice and the blue really made my skin tone pop a little bit I guess bright colors do that so I have a second one of the dress and if my memory serves this should be some songs Absolutely. I bought simple eyes. And these ones are cotton. Are they actually? Wait, how many are in there? I do not even know. I think they are cotton. And I also think there are 10 of them in there. Because 
thongs for the women. Honestly, you can't have too much black because you can never find them anyways when you're looking for them. So there's that. So now I need to make sure that I'm putting all the trash together so I can take it out before it gets too late. I thought that. I thought that I was going to come home and sleep um, earlier because last night I ended up leaving the party at like 12.30. So when I got home, it was like a little bit after one and I just came home, washed my face off and came straight to sleep because I'm like, um... I have to be up by 5 a.m. so I don't have no time to be sitting around playing around so I just went to sleep. This morning when I woke up I felt like I was hit by a bus. This is how you know that you're getting older because um, the way how I felt. I felt like an old lady. Camera battery just died so I had to charge that up. I think I'm going to put the cell rose in the fridge because uh, I already know it's so lopsided it's, it's terrible. I just can't be great. So I'm going to put the cell rose in the fridge because I already know what the Pinot Grigio tastes like because I always have Pinot Grigio, and like I said, it is my favorite wine. So I'm gonna put this Stella Rosa in the fridge and I'm gonna add this to my collection. I bought, I don't think I came on and show y'all. I bought these rubber wine stoppers on Amazon because we have this, oh, wait, I have a wine in the fridge already. I think I'll drink that, let me show y'all. I actually have three in the fridge. I have some sorrel in the fridge. I have this. This is what I bought her last night. This is absolutely amazing. It's just 7% alcohol, but this is really, really good. As in, like, you can drink, I can drink two bottles, three bottles of this, and I'm still fine, literally. This is what the wine stopper looks like. I did not expect it to do that. But how exciting is that? I'm gonna pour a little glass of this because why not? Um, honestly, I had planned that I was gonna come home and sleep. However, this is giving aesthetics right now and I feel like I should just ride the wave, you know? And honestly, I need some better glasses than these ones because these right now are not it no more. Glass, half empty, I guess. Perspective, you know? This is it. So I don't think I'm gonna end up putting either of these in the fridge right now because there's already this. I have sorrel and I and we have teleport in the fridge and teleport is like red. I think this one is red too, but I'm not. I'm gonna just leave it alone. I think I'm gonna rearrange over here because I wanna put. I think I wanna put this little setup over here. Step. Anyways, we have a little moment over here, you know. But I think I wanna see if I can comfortably rearrange the garden. This huge ass teleport bottle been empty. So let me, let me show y'all all that I have right now. I have this mix really, really good. I have this Prosecco. I have this Merlot, it's like red wine. And then I have like rum, like rum to mix into something. One of my coworkers went to Guyana and she brought, brought me back this El Dorado. So I have that little one right there. Oh, this is actually gonna hold, kind of, but not really. So this just needs to be forced into the corner like so. And I'm gonna place these back on there. <laughs> we have this one too. What is? What is this? This is good. All right. Pop a wine stopper in there, throw it in the fridge because this tastes really good. Oh, the bottle is so long though. And then I have this huge container of Ciroc that Jules had bought me because she felt like I didn't have much of a variety for when other people come over, so she bought me Ciroc. And she bought me this Jose Cuevo. So, um, there's that. So from here on out, it's safe to say that I want to add to the collection. You know, we have a little setup going on there, a cute little bar area, you know? I want to add to the collection, obviously, because this is not done. But for the most part, that's what we have right now. So um, I'm going to enjoy this glass of wine while I change and like get the trash together because I have to bring the trash out before it gets too late because I really hate taking out the trash and I didn't realize that I hated taking out the trash until right now. <laughs> well, not right now. Like the last four months, I realized I really hate taking out the trash. <laughs> so there's that. So much discomfort, and I'm gonna put these back in the fridge because we're not using them right now, so. But look how the little wine stoppers come in so handy. 
I wanted them to be more cute, but I'm like, all right, let's be practical. They're just in there to like keep the wine closed so that it stays fresh or like it makes sense or whatever. I don't know. I have two bottles of smoothie in the fridge that I made a little bit now. So I obviously need to throw them away because smoothies, you're supposed to drink it. When you make it, I don't know me. I would not comfortably be Janine if the shit I did made complete sense all the time. So now we're here. So um, I need to throw that out. Yep, it smells funny. Like it's gonna give me the runs if I eat it. If I drink it, what am I saying? Oh, uh, a little bar setup looks so nice actually. There's so much things on the table. We have like a candy container on that same stand. And it's so full, I do not even want to show it. I feel so good about that little bar air right now because I feel like I could comfortably entertain and have something that everybody would drink. Even though I feel like I'm trying to get my adult friends into drinking wine because why not? I'm not gonna lie, most of them are into hard liquor. I literally cannot explain why I still have this smoothie from so long. Everything I buy, I buy in bulk. So this is like bulk Ziploc bags from Amazon. One thing about my Amazon Prime, Girl, I'm using it. So many bags from work because some days you just forget that they're in your pockets. But these bags are what we use for like the recycle. I don't know if anybody else is like me, but when it's trash day, I'm looking for every and anything that could potentially be trash and it is going. I don't want it in here after a trash day. I like when it feels like light and airy inside here after the trash goes out. Trash is pretty much figured out. I need to put away the planes, but I, I don't feel like doing that right now. I just want to drink the wine right now and be an adult, you know? As tired as I am these days, I've decided that I'm not going to come home and just run to sleep anymore because I feel like even though I don't sleep for long, I do not really feel productive when I wake up and that's so annoying because the aim is not to feel productive when I come home because I had a whole productive day but like it just don't be it, honestly. I'm going to change right now and probably watch some Netflix and I will see you guys later if anything. Wow, my face is literally so greasy. Also, last night when I came home, I tied my hair down so quickly because I've been new that this morning I just wouldn't have no time to get up and like do my hair before I go, you know. I'm wondering if when I come home from work tomorrow, if I'm gonna be in the mood to go do my laundry. The only reason why I'm not doing it right now is because today is Sunday. Why do these look so small? Also, these days I've really just been in a, I just be feeling like my, um, They're really good quality because I bought them before, so we'll put those in the wash. If you don't wash your underwear before you wear it, even if you wear liners, I'm judging you heavy right now because you're supposed to. I really like how the roses look in here. Somebody's son needs to make this a habit. From here on out, I need to always have roses because that's such a lot. You know? I need to tackle this box of hangers. You know what? I think I'm gonna hang up the hangers right now even if I don't throw the box out because today's trash day. So anything that I think needs to go is going today. I think I'll put some of the hangers out here for now. And then I'll put the rest inside here. I really need to start transitioning both. <laughs>